and then we'll get I'll get started just talking about the various pieces that you can come to create ambiance to uh, reinforce the the wacky scientist theme but be doable and fairly inexpensive to execute too so we've used a lot of uh, glass vases. You can get these at a thrift store. Oh my gosh. If you go on the right day, if you go on 10 Cent Tuesday, you can get them for 10 cents. But otherwise, they sell for $1.99 or $1.50. So it's pretty reasonable. And we're using feather dusters. So we're using the same thing in the very back there, hanging from the ceiling. Those are just feather dusters that I got from the hardware store. And here's what you do. You go up and down every single aisle of the hardware store and you just use your imagination as how you can uh, make something into a fabulous prop. So anyways, we've got these feather dusters, green crinkle wrap was always great. We're going to talk about this labeling that we came up with that we used on each of the tables as well as in small ways such as this, as well as making it bigger and using those labels as uh, really dynamic graphic elements in, in the very back. So we'll talk about those labels some more. Here we've got some outdoor plumbing. It folds over. We just gave it a quick coat of paint. I'm not sure how good that really was. You probably could have kept it black and it would have been just fine. So what we're doing is we're just la we're building layers. So if I had just had this, that's not nearly as exciting as building layers on top of this medium to reinforce our theme and to continue to create that excitement. So, a simple way, you know, here we go, we've got from the hardware store as well, I think this is $1.29. You know, you put any color acetate in there, you can get that on the roll, by, on the roll at Michael's, you can get it at party supply stores, and just about any color. So it's just a real, real quick and inexpensive way to get a lot of oomph out there. So these are puck lights that typically hang from your ceiling, and if you're buying the kind that are battery operated, uh, they usually come with a remote. So we've made friends with these puck lights. I got mine at Sam's Club. You can get them anywhere, and they're pretty cheap too. So continuing on, we can create small displays using leftover jars at home. Now for the for when we are out interacting with the kids in the lobby, I wanted to make sure that there's a lid on top. So, these have lids on top. They're nice and secure. This is a really interesting thing. So, once again, all of our glassware comes from, came from the thrift stores. And uh, if you pull back and later see all the aspects of this room, there's a lot of glassware in here and we got it all for $31. So that's pretty good, considering you can spend $31 on just one vase, really, especially a tall one. So this is filled with those scented beads. Got those from the dollar store. They were a dollar. They came in a container about that big, and they're for fragrance. So those come in a, a whole bunch of colors. So those really look nice and scientific right off the bat. And just what you can get from thrift stores are just this interesting shape of containers. Also from the party supply store, we got these um, test tubes and we just filled them up with more of those scented beads and that quickly brought some color and a lot of life to those test tubes. Now these candlesticks also came from a thrift store and um, these balls right now, right now are being sold in athletic stores and they are great. So they've got a logo on them of course, but you can kind of slide that to the back. And this was $1.99, so I thought that that was a fabulous way to bring in a bunch of color without us having to paint it, save some time, and it's super exciting.